Hey, what's up everybody? It's Andrew with Run Guns. And today we're going to go over the Recon Ballistic Sunglasses by Core Essentials. Now, this isn't just going to be an unboxing. This is going to be a full review. So, meaning I'm going to go over its contents, show you guys what it comes with at first, my first impressions. But then I'm going to pause the video, wear it for a few weeks, and then come back and give you my full, honest opinion afterwards. Now, Core Essentials did send this out to me for review and full transparency, but that's not going to sway me one way or another. And I believe every product has its own pros and cons. And my job here in this video is to highlight those pros and cons for you to help you make an informed decision whether you consider buying it or not. So if you guys like this video, like, share, subscribe. Without further ado, let's get started. So first thing you'll notice is this paper that comes on top. You will see that it has a 30 day money back guarantee. So if you're not satisfied with it, you could always return it to them free of charge. I do see here that it does have a warranty. It's a one year warranty. It doesn't cover anything but pretty much manufacturer defects. So if you scratch it or you break it or something that's not really covered, it's more um, any defects that comes with the product. Now, if you see there top, what is that a promo code? You're welcome. And you know, some key features that you'll see here like magnetic, it's polarized, which is awesome. It's ballistic. It has the highest ballistic ratings available for sunglasses on the market, which is pretty cool. And it's supposed to be pretty comfortable. So that's that. So first thing I notice is, you know, they do feel like pretty heavy duty. These are not like lightweight, tiny range glasses. Doesn't say they don't feel too heavy for glasses, but they definitely feel heavy duty in construction. I could already feel that off the plastic. If I close it, that snap right there is basically the magnet working. Requires a good amount of force right there. So if you want to lock it down on your sleeve, you know, for storage purposes, you can certainly do that and shouldn't have any issues. Most people think like, you know, glasses usually come out and they kind of thin out towards the end. But what's cool about this is that this area, this flat area actually distributes the weight for, or that pressure that you're going to feel when you put hearing protection on when you're at the range. So kind of something, you know, you don't really think about too often, but something I look for in range glasses and I especially like this. So really excited to take it out to the range and see how it does. So the magnets themselves, you can see them there. So here you can see where the magnets would be on either side. So obviously they're inserted within this area. There you can see some details within. And the material itself on the frame does feel like a smooth plastic, kind of has like a matte black feel to it and look to it. I do like how it has like a wider area here on the sides, which does offer you more protection against anything, you know, that might escape or go in or around like a casing or something at the range. So I think that's pretty cool. So the magnetic visor strap is pretty simple, but pretty ingenious the way it works. So all you gotta do is open it up. And what you do is you'll strap it around just as such to your sun visor. And basically what you're gonna wanna do, there's two points of magnetism on these glasses and there's two points here. As you can see, the brand logo is gonna be facing down and then it'll just wrap around like that. I'll be testing it out on my vehicle and I'll show you all how it actually looks and how it operates. But that's basically the concept. Now this is what they're calling your travel tube. And obviously this is the case for your sunglasses. And what's nice about it, it does have a nice like felt material inside of here. So obviously that'll be scratch resistant, you know, so you don't have to worry about scratching it up and pretty convenient little tube, you know, it's shaped for a cup holder. So you could definitely put it in your center console or, you know, wherever it is you have cup holders in your life. So this will seal up and then, you know, good to go. And you could bring your cloth, kind of throw that in there. And that way, you know, you could clean your glasses or whatever, whenever you need to. Uh, I picture this being pretty cool for out on the boat. You know, you could kind of put that there in your cup holder and kind of pull out your, your glasses whenever you need them. So I first wanted to go to an indoor range to see how these glasses will perform under indoor conditions, because obviously you might be walking in and out of places. Although I understand that the original intention is to be probably more outdoors. They are sunglasses. You know, obviously if you needed clear indoor glasses, you could do that for the range. But anyways, they did perform very well. I was able to obviously see my targets well, didn't really have glare from any lights above me or anything like that because they're polarized and it was more than enough to be able to see my targets which i was happy with so as you can see i just attached it on you know pretty simple on off my car is pretty compact it's a honda civic so this is actually pretty small you know my visor so i had a little extra just kind of coiled it up there so it's out of the way and i'll show you now how it securely attaches on so once you have the magnets lined up it's pretty secure i could open this up move it around side to side and it's basically not falling unless you purposely want to remove it. So 
the fit is very secure once you line it up. In terms of the case being in the cup holder, it fits very conveniently. You could put the cap on the bottom, put it in, and it's secure and very easy to use and pretty universal, you know, for whatever you're using it for, whether it's a boat, car, whatever as a cup holder. So I have been using them to drive around and as you could expect with polarized glasses, it does reduce glare and increase your visibility, especially under very bright conditions. I live in South Florida, so it's always nice to wear polarized glasses and you know, they worked as expected. So with some help from my passenger, you can see how putting the glasses on does improve your visibility. It does make it slightly darker or a different tint, but it mainly just reduces the glare, which is what's important for a nice driving experience. So any excuse I have to go out on the range, I'm gonna take it. And you know, I took out the glasses, I brought out a few guns, tried a couple things out. I believe it was like one or two in the afternoon, so it was extremely bright outside. So a great opportunity to actually test these glasses. And just like driving or anything else I've done throughout the video, I really had no issues with it. It was comfortable to shoot. I did have the over the ear hearing protection on for probably three hours and I didn't really have any issues with it. Like I mentioned earlier, that flat surface kind of distributes the pressure on that area near the temple. So the color looks great, really didn't have any issues. It was comfortable to shoot. And as you can see here, I was just having a good time and really the glasses were a great addition to the range. So like in all my reviews, I try to highlight some of the pros and cons of each product. And some of the cons that I was able to come up with for this particular product is that it may weigh slightly more than some of its competitors. And that's probably due to the magnets that it has inside. Now, I don't think this is a very noticeable or very significant difference, but it is there for those of you that might be mindful of that. But again, the magnets do provide some advantages over the other competitors, which they don't have obviously. Now, another con might potentially be the price. I know it's not the cheapest you know, set of glasses out there, but again, I think this is one of those cases where you get what you pay for. So overall, I'm very happy with the glasses. I think they're excellent. I'd recommend them to anyone. And if you guys have any questions or comments, just leave it down below. Like, share, subscribe. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next one. WRG, out.